boardwalk after several shots were fired earlier this morning. Well, a hail of bullets sent five people to the hospital and one of them now fighting for their lives. Well, News 12's Jericho Train is on the ground watching this investigation unfold and speaking to neighbors about their thoughts on this terrifying shooting incident. This is the worst year ever. Children hold the hands of their parents, heading to the sand and water, stepping past a crime scene filled with bullet casings, littering the boardwalk and spilling onto the sand. This is an everyday thing. Everyday thing. Someone is always getting shot in this neighborhood. Police tell us this all happened around 2 a.m. when a large group gathered on the boardwalk. At this hour, they do not know who or how many people fired those shots. Our News 12 crew counted at least 24 bullet markers on the ground. It's scary because I have kids and I have grandkids, you know, I have to worry about them also. When police arrived, they found two women ages 26 and 27, both shot in the leg and one 36 year old man shot in the chin. Two men were taken to Coney Island Hospital later, a 19 year old who was shot in the leg and a 31 year old in critical condition after he was shot in the back. The long list of victims scaring off some of the visitors. We have all these beautiful things in our area and we can't even use them. I don't know if I'm going to come back. Locals off camera pointed to the large signs displayed throughout the beach with the boardwalk hours saying this type of gathering shouldn't have happened at the time it did. Others questioned why the violence continues to shake up neighborhoods across the city. Five people got shot. What's going on? Like, why is it? How come there's not enough? I. I I support the police 100%, but I don't know why this keeps happening, you know. And while the amount of people shot right here just hours ago has really shocked neighbors, police tell us that shooting incidents and shooting victims are actually down this year compared to last year. Shooting incidents, there was 701 shooting incidents this year compared to 791 shooting incidents last year. And shooting victims, there were 842 victims this year compared to 915 last year. So as this investigation continues to unfold, we'll continue to bring you the very latest in Coney Island, Jericho Tran News 12. Mm -hmm.